Hey gorgeous, how are you doing? I hope well. Today's video, I'm gonna be talking about some Hermes tea, you know, as our news, um, as I've been doing for the last couple of months and I didn't realize initially that this would be a segment, but here we are, girl. So let's go straight into it. The first thing is the fact that there was a private sale in June on my birthday and I didn't go. <laughs> I got the invitation, um, I got the invitation beginning of June and I was gutted because we had already bought tickets to go to Milan. If you haven't seen the vlog, it's over here. And so like I ended up not going, I was pissed off, but you know what? Like it's a time, once in a lifetime experience that I was gonna have with my family and I could not pray that, you know, because I wanted to go to the sale. Um, the sale took place from the 21st until the 23rd of June and you know when i got the invitation i could still go on the first days guys yeah i, I was mad so yeah this is the first launch one of jewelry of high jewelry this week from fms and the collection is stunning you know i've seen on the website give my invitation to go see it on two week a week ago if, you, if you'd like to see it if you are in paris and you you would like to see it it's on the faubourg uh faubourg uh, boutique from the 7th until the 31st of july and I urge you to go because it is gorgeous, you know, at least from the pictures that I've seen online. And in discussion with my essay, she was like, yes, this collection is beautiful. It's gonna do really well. And, um, uh, you know, I wanted to go, but like like this, sick like this, I'm sick. My husband is sick. My son is sick. Like, you know, we don't want to take risks. And then hopefully next week, we can go. concerning special orders. I'm trying to get put up for another one, for another special order after I received this one that I that is coming. Um, and it's simply because I, I won't be here in France. You know, as you guys know, some of you may know, I'm moving to Angola and I cannot, you know, if a bag comes, I won't be able to like drive, you know, pick it up. So I asked, my, with, I discussed with my essay and she told me, okay, I said, I cannot confirm anything, you know, but you know, it's not the first time that a client will be getting special orders back to back. You know, we certainly have clients and she even told me like, they're only clients that only accept special orders, that only have special orders and they already have this unlock with my manager. I guess I'm going to ask and, but it's looking good for you. And I'm so happy, especially when I removed all of that stuff for my wish list. And she's like, yeah, yeah, that's good. That it gives you, it gives you more, more prospects into getting another order so it's positive so oh, guys I'm going to confirm I'm gonna let you know I'm gonna let you know if I get it or not another point that we see that I saw a lot at the beginning of the year which was um, about the how many bags can a person or can a client be offered um, from Hermes in a year or at least for 2022 um, in the beginning of the year we saw that I think it was one quota for one bag and you have to be really careful with which bag you would take, you know, if they offered you a picotin, whatever the case may be. Guys, you know me, I went to my essay and I was like, girl, like you sold me this picotin. You sold me a picotin this, you know, two weeks ago. Like, does that mean that I cannot be, um, and I can, that I cannot receive another bag? And she's like, no. And then she was like, okay, maybe it's not nonsense. Maybe it, it, this is the system for different countries. And, but from my, from my experience, you know, from people that I know here in France, I've seen people get more than two quarter bags a year. Like, at the second semester and I know someone personally who has had two bags offered, quota ones. So I don't know if things are linear, you know, if things are the same everywhere, but you know, um, I don't know. You let me down in the comments. Have you, have you seen or do you know anyone who has had two uh, quota bags this year? I special orders are blocked for now. Uh, my essay said that the special orders are blocked for now because of the large backlog from last seasons and they're trying to have everything finished first before approving the new color charts the new season color charts um, and this is why you know I'm kind of waiting because I'm so excited guys. the chart hasn't been released yet so we're waiting on that and I'm very very excited to see what they have for the, on the new chart. Another thing that my essay told me is that since my special order now is can be considered as late as a little bit delayed you know, because here in France, the space for a special order to get, you know, to, from order to client, it's usually 10 months, 10 to 12 months, but my essay was really firm on the 10 months. And she said that if at, by the end of this month, my order isn't um, in hand, you know, isn't with me, she can in fact call the factory and try to understand, 
you know, try to get like try to get an understanding. Like, you know, it's it's really cool that they can actually call and try. When we were on the phone, she was like, okay, so your special order was done on the 25th of August. It was approved on da -da 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 -da, on the 1st of September, and it was sent to uh, Paris on the 1st of October, or you know, things like that. She gave me all those dates, and she's like, okay, if they really get to pass the 10 months, take into consideration that you are living in France, I will call. You know, I'm gonna take this responsibility of calling and making sure that everything is okay so you can take your bag with you when you move next month so yay um, yes another thing that i spoke with my essay was how amazing you know just in, con in conversation with her we talked about the display none the display of the store is amazing it's almost as amazing as the one in paris why aren't why isn't your display so you know vivacious and grand and she was like, because stores like this, you know, where there's a larger flux of clients, international clients, the stores are bigger and the stock is bigger, meaning that the stock in each color comes at the same time. And this is why they're able to create displays with different colors. And she was even saying like, it is the dream when you work in a store like that, because that means that you have stock. Even though the girls in Milan were telling people that they had no stock, they had no bags, and all the displays were like packed at like, Guys, I'm telling you, the display in Milan was probably the best I've seen ever. And I haven't been to Paris, you know, so I don't, I don't know. I don't even know. But those one, that store in Milan, Chef's Kiss, it had every single color. It was summer inside that store, and I loved it. The fact that, you know, something that I've been noticing, you know, here and there is that I haven't had really poor experience in a, at Hermes Express, with the exception of the one in Paris, you know, the George V. That was super packed and everything and my recommendation for myself even moving forward is if i am to go there to have an appointment my friend that was with us in uh, in madrid in uh, milan she was like just here like how do you summon these people how do they just relax around you and they give you always are able to explain things you know like how does it happen like what do you do and she was like i was like no listen like you were here you see me talking to them it's how i talk to you it's like guys don't switch up you know, one thing that my essay told me is that they can tell, like when you're trying to be something else, they have really good training, especially store managers, like they have training. So I would say it comes down to your attitude, how how relaxed you are and how at ease you are at, the, at their environment. And, um, and this can really make the experience great, you know? So like when you are to go to an MS store, it's like it's a store like any other it's like you're going to a grocery store except that there it's a really expensive one the experience have a good time and um we are right at the end of the video i hope you enjoyed it i love you all so much you know and excuse you know i'm in a different setting guys i'm moving okay it's crazy over here and i'm sick as well so yeah you guys i'm just trying to pump and push at this point okay i hope you all enjoyed this video and i see you all in the next one goodbye